everybody. Happy Tuesday. Welcome to the Luscious Dot Life. My name is Lucia, if you're new here. And I'm really excited. Today we have a special guest, Rhonda Edelstein, who is a health and wellness coach and uh, also coaches me and is a really good friend. And I think you're going to find her uh, very interesting. And we're going to be doing a lot more collaborations in the future. And you can check her out at Awareness within.com. I'm just really excited. So here we go. Have a wonderful, wonderful Tuesday. Bye everybody. Hi, Rhonda Edelstein here for the Luscious Dot Life. I'm a certified health and wellness coach at awarenesswithin.com. Lucia is a current client of mine and asked me to contribute here on the Luscious Dot Life. I feel called to just really acknowledge how much information is out there and how overwhelming it can be in the realm of health, wellness, food, nutrition, exercise, all of it. I mean, I can be overwhelmed at times and I work in this field. Any moment you can go online and you can find contradicting information, all the latest trends, what's new, what's hot, how to make sense of it all. And that's really essentially what I do as a health coach. I help you identify what your goals are and your intentions and, and desires, and then how to sift through all the information out there to find what fits for you. And that's why I called my, my business Awareness Within, because I really feel like that's the place that it comes from, getting to know you, and bringing you into the equation. And I feel so often that's what's missing in terms of you know all the diet and latest trends out there. How does it fit for you? So I just wanna share a tool with you that I use. I also studied spiritual psychology. So I bring a lot of that into how I work. And one of the principles I learned there was to use knowledge and information in service to your heart. And how I interpret that or how I use that in the health and wellness world is to take information or knowledge that you receive and like filter it through your heart. Filter it through like what feels authentic and right for you. Many of us have a hard time doing this in the beginning, but as we slow down and take the pause and spend a little bit more time going within, and I help people create that space, you can get to know what feels good for you, what feels like the right fit. And I kind of like to think of it like I go shopping and I choose several things that I want to try on and I think some things will look good on me and other things I'm drawn to and I, I take them and I don't know until I try it, like, oh, this is a good fit. This doesn't feel right. This doesn't suit my body. And I feel like it's the same thing in a way in terms of food and lifestyle and, and wellness rituals. And we just have to try them on. We just have to try them out and see, how do I fit into this equation? How does this work for me? So I encourage you to try that. I'd love to hear any feedback you have, and I'll be coming back with more tips and suggestions for you in the upcoming weeks and months. Take care.